Chris. Everybody knows the rules. Hi, Grayson. How are you? Welcome to the Slay the Bias podcast. I'm Vinny. I'm great, Vinny. I'm Grayson, and this is the podcast. And we're here with Derek. Hi, I'm Derek, and this is the podcast. I will. Yeah. Good job, Derek. I love you. All right. That's I love you, we, too. That's it. We can go home. Thank you. It. So let's just uh, let's just dive right into it. Let's uh, talk about the weeks. Yay. What is in that uh, drink right there? It is water. Are sure it's not cocaine? Yeah, it's just water. Okay. Maybe, maybe some amphetamines? No, it's just water. Okay. I'm naturally energetic. <laughs> I love that about you. Thank it's, you for bringing why, your energy to the podcast yeah, this week. That's yeah. We, that's why we got you here. Grace's coffee is not being drunk at all, and his energy is oh. quite low. You know what? You're right. Let me take the next 30 minutes and drink the rest of this coffee, and then I'll join you in the back, mean, on the back half. You, you should be able to finish that. Yeah, you should be able to finish that in like yeah. two minutes. No, I will. Let's start. get stomach aches. I'll start it. right now. Yeah, I had a pretty good week. Tell me about it. You ever had the uh, the Beyond Beef, Beyond Meat, or whatever it is? Yeah, Beyond, no, Beyond Burger. I, I've wanted to try it, though. I bought it at Wegmans. I had, I had the alternative. Wegies. Don't do that. <laughs> I had the alternative to... It's like, what, you know, the... What's up? <laughs> I'm going to at Wegmans later. This is the new ad campaign for them. Wegies. <laughs> Continue, Grayson. Um, I had the alternative to that, the uh, Impossible Burger. I had the Impossible Meatballs, though. I want to have the Impossible Burger, but I don't have it in a, at a restaurant. So uh, I did have it. I had it at uh, Clover. I'm going to start here and say that... Uh, oh, I don't know what Clover is. It was really good. Uh, it tasted like meatballs. We bought yeah. the burger patties at Waggies oh, and uh, cooked them in the, fr- in the frying pan, so we didn't grill it. So it definitely tasted different, but it was good. It was really easy to cook, I too. Think, yeah, you, three minutes on each side. You have to cook them differently. Like it's almost better to like leave them in your fridge and let them dry out because mm. the biggest problem is the them being too juicy. Didn't say that. Well, I mean that's why I say almost. It's not. Re- it's not actually recommended, but it's use the biggest problem with them is they get juicy on the inside and you gotta like cook them in a certain way so that they sear and don't se- seal on the juices. How mm. close did it taste to a burger? Not very close. At all. T- so you know when you have t- TV dinners with it's like a little burger, a hungry man TV dinner. I haven't had one. It tastes kind of like a microwave like, hamburger, like the meatloaf, but it's not terrible. Kind of like meatloaf, like a like a like a. It didn't taste terrible, like a Salisbury it steak. Healthy, I guess, yeah, I would say that. That's Do you guys have yeah. a grill He's here? Correct. No. Oh, okay. Salisbury steak isn't really steak, is it? No. It's ground, right? It's not. I don't know what it is. It's, it's not ground. Steak. It's Let not, me ask uh, not... Gary Busey in Rookie of the Year. <laughs> 90s callback. <laughs> what a good. Guys. What a good reference. This was, is the I best gonna, Salisbury steak I ever had. I was gonna ask the Fallout series. Fallout three and Fallout four. You can get Salisbury. Is steak. that a book series? No, the games. Like a board game? Yeah. Okay. And a, it's a mobile game, actually. <laughs> mobile only. Oh, good. I have my phone. Have Fallout? Yeah, they made a mobile game. Really? Fallout Shelter. It was a good game. I played it for a while. Yeah? Uh, Yeah. I ran 4.75 miles last night. Wow. I what walked, time? Uh, I walked like eight like kilometers. Like 45 minutes. It was not good. I walked like eight kilometers playing Pokemon Go. Nice. I'm running six miles on Sunday for the BAA. Can't wait for that. Get excited. Uh, but I get to have pizza afterwards. The sound, That's my the sound reward. <laughs> That's exciting. Uh, I went to my niece's birthday party on Saturday in Central Mass. Ooh, fun. A lot of kids. A lot of kids. But they have a cat, so that's cool, too. What's the cat's name again? They have two. They have Tilly. Tilly. And I think Buttercup or something. Oh, hello. Cats. Uh, Kit, kit, yep. kits, kits. I went to DC this weekend, this past weekend. Nice, nice. Flew down, I was in flew D- down on Friday. I got back from DC last night. <laughs> really, really? Yeah, dope. Um, I was sitting next to a cu- an elder, not an, like a middle aged couple on the plane. Uh, on the way back, sitting next to the same middle aged couple. Oh, no, we bought really? the same seats. Yeah. Donald and Melania were there. No, yeah, <laughs> no, they're an elderly couple. Oh, um, no, yeah, it was like it was really funny because it was the same. It was the same exact people because I was in seat number C. I was three C, row three, seat number C. You know, yeah. And uh, I had the same seat flying down and back, and I flew down after work hours on a Friday and flew back at like nine p.m. on a Sunday. So they had the same flight. They like I sat next to them down and back, and then the uh, guy across the aisle, three D maybe C D yeah three D was also the same dude. Like same, like the same four people. Wah, wah, the wee, two wah. people to the left and the one, but all four of us were the same people. Wah, wah, wee, what wah. airline? Spirit. How really? was the bus? <laughs> the Airbus. 
No, that that brings shame. Do to... you have to move that, Derek? Yeah. You asked for this, and I bought you one. Did I ask for this? Yeah, you said last week, where's mine? Oh, yeah. Wait, and you I... bought him that mic well, stand? We need another one anyway. I mean, okay. We're still missing one. Um, right. um, but yeah, so, well, you have the tripod one. Yeah, but he asked for this, and he's like literally just going to take it off so, the table. So I flew down Spirit, stayed with my friend from college. Uh, we went to some bars in D.C., and then flew back on Sunday. <laughs> you went to D.C. to bar hop? Yep. How was wow. Your, how was your Spirit experience? It was fine. I aborted in group two or zone two because I was row three. So they let row three board in group two because, of course, they do. I still think my favorite, have, like the joke on the Internet is like, is there a doctor aboard? I'm like, <laughs> no, it's spirit. Yeah. <laughs> this is a spirit flight. Doctors don't fly I'll never, spirit. I'll never forget Vinny and I flying spirit. It was bad. I, I, had, a, I had a single backpack and a, and a coat. So. Do they charge you for that? No. It's really? A per, it's a personal item and a piece of clothing. I thought they charged you for that stuff. No, the personal item is like a purse, typically, but you can use a backpack as a personal item. Uh, so a carry-on is something that has like wheels and you put in the overhead bin, but I yeah. didn't have a carry-on. I just yeah. had a backpack. Personal item. Nice. My, my coat, piece of clothing. Put it on. It's not a personal item. I am flying on Monday to Where? Little Rock. Oh, I've heard it's beautiful. Arkansas. This time of year. I'm going to Arkansas. You're going to Arkansas? Yes. Flying Del- uh, Delta, though. America, please explain why this Arkansas and this not Arkansas? That's a good question. You know. America, explain. It's very, it's, you know. Referencing I've vines from two. Never been to Arkansas. So uh, I guess I'm in for a treat. Why, cool. What are you doing down there? Work. Fun. Yeah. How not, long are you there for? Pleasure. Are you flying Spirit? <laughs> Fuck no. <laughs> Employer is paying for it. I am not flying Spirit. JetBlue? Uh, Delta. 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 I don't Delta. think JetBlue Delta. flies to Little Rock. Southwest? Probably. I don't. Just I usually fly Delta. Oh, that's the know. good old... Uh, is that... Uh, United? No, I believe... American? Is that... Um, U.S. Air? Is that... Uh, Bill Clinton Airport? Yeah, well, the Cl- Hil- Bill and Hillary Airport or some shit. The Bill yeah. and Clinton... Hil- <laughs> Bill and Hillary that. Clinton Their names Airport. were on it. That's weird. Are they both from Arkansas? I would assume so. I'm still waiting for the Obama Hillary's buildings. from hell! Where are the Obama buildings? Still waiting for him. I don't think Trump's going to allow it. No, he definitely wouldn't. But he I won't think, even allow Harry Tubman on the fucking final bill. The, I think the Clinton buildings were probably named during Obama years, so I think we have to wait for another Democratic government. So 2024? God, I hope not. <laughs> nope. That would be real sad. <sighs> How do you like the, the 35 Democratic candidates? When's the debates? <laughs> like next week oh, or this God. weekend or something. I don't know. I can't wait to watch it. I'm I'm uh, confused about why only one famous person is uh, in the first debate. Who's it's, m- it's just Warren. Oh really? Yeah, Did she's, she's alone. Ones? No, she's alone with all the plebs. It's like and then, it's like and the then, ma- it's like the you know the pre-show for the next night. She's the, she's the opener because they don't want to have Bernie and uh, well Bernie e. E. Warren go at it. I guess. I don't but, know. Yeah, no, Bernie and uh, and Kamala and Booker <laughs> and Buddha Judge are all in the second debate. Is that how you say his name? Buttigieg. I thought it was Buddha Leg or some shit. No, Buttigieg. Mayor Pete. It's easier calling that. Mayor Pete. Mayor Pete. The open, My man. openly gay he's gonna make, mayor of he's South gonna Bend, make Indiana. A great vice president. I can't wait. I can't wait. For, I would like a a, a Harris Buttigieg. No, because that, want, it will never happen though. Because and no, I don't think hit. there's ever been a presidential candidate who that made the candidacy that uh that picked one of the previous running people as their running mate. Uh, you never know, right? Does that know. ever happen? I think it's for the likability they have to do something like that this time. Like, it would have been so fucking easy for Hillary to have picked Bernie as her running mate. Yeah, but the, the, v, the VP does nothing, though. It's You want to take him out of the Senate? True. It's like not worth It's not worth it. Like, I thought about, like, why don't you have Bernie and Warren run together, but you want to take Warren Wait, out of the Senate? Wait, she did take a senator. Tim Kaine. Who the fuck is Tim Kaine? Tim Kaine's a senator. Who gives a shit? He's who's, a fucking senator. But who's... Bur- he's a Democratic I'd ra- senator. I'd rather have Bernie in the fucking Senate than Tim Kaine. Fair, but that argument about I take him I, out of the Senate. I forgot matter. Tim Kaine was even alive to this conversation. Yeah, that's fair. Hi, how are you? Good stuff. Good stuff. Good thanks. Politics. I don't. Like, I don't think Harris is going to win. When do I get way. to talk about my no, week? No, I really want. Didn't you already go? <laughs> he hasn't even talked at all. No. Are you serious? Did we? This is the second time in a row we we've got, done this. We got uh, sidetracked. All right. How was your week? I don't want to talk about it anymore. Anyways, <laughs> Harris isn't going to. It was good. <laughs> um. Oh, it was good. <laughs> Uh, I was in D.C. the Good past, to hear. the past few days. I got back last night. Cool, cool. We Who'd you fly? JetBlue. DC at the Knew same it. time. JetBlue all day. Um, I like a JetBlue. Pre-check. Yeah, yeah. Me too. Course, Me too. Course, I have it too. It's, we're white. It's, it's fucking this best. 
Pre-check is re- well. Can't you just do it with your military ID? Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, you no, don't, you, you, you don't need it. it. You just put in the the DOD number and it gives you pre-check when you submit get the ticket. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, because you, know, you don't clearance. need to have it. Yeah. It's yeah. Just, it's pre-check's the best, and then they say, "Any military here want to board first? And mm-hmm. I'm like, "See you in the back of the plane. Goodbye." Grayson, do you have pre-check? No. Oh, you should fucking get pre-check. It's so great. I know. I need to do it, but I'm just lazy. It's like um, that. Just walking past everybody, all the all the peasants without hi. it. Hi. Do the queen. Wave. You don't have to take hi. off your shoes. Take off your laptop. Especially on a, mon- on a yeah. Monday. And it's like packed at the airport. And you're just like, no, I don't have time for this shit. And just wheel right by him. Yeah. Yeah. I don't remember the last time I waited longer than like five minutes in the security line. It's great. Um, yeah. Last last weekend was was Father's Day. It was Dad's Day. Mm. Mm-hmm. So we did dad stuff. We we're going to golf. Did you, did you do dad stuff with your dad? Yeah. Yay. Yeah. We got him golf, golf balls and a hat. How much do you think a 12 pack of golf balls is? $25. Mm, 50 bucks. We got we got Damn, him. those are some good balls. Yeah, we <laughs> we got them Pro That's V. That's a sound clip. <laughs> we got them Pro V ones, and those are like the best balls in golf. And they were forty seven dollars, I believe. Nice. What if he loses those balls? He's going to. Did you buy a service plan for those? No service plan. Damn. Oh, I have a confession. You can still add it on up to ten days after your purchase. That's I have true. a confession to make. Uh, so you said sound drops and clips like that. I've become addicted to the Audacity Echo feature. Apologies for last episode. A lot of echoing in that episode, like. Oops. Dro- dropping in. Oops. I like it a lot. Stop. My stomach hurts. Okay. okay. Uh, anyway, that was that your week? <laughs> was that it? Um, You going to eat bars in D.C.? No. I went to the W. It was for... You been to the W? It was for empo- employment. For work. It was for work. Oh. What did you do after work? I went to bed. I worked um, really hard. I was tired. <laughs> so I was, uh, I was only there for I one... I watched Netflix. I was okay. there for one night... Um. That's so right. Tuesday night, I went out. With Big Little Lies came out with the lady's sister, who I know, that's still HBO. still lives in DC. Oh. Uh. Do, so with your employer, you traveled, did you hear what I say? Yeah, lady sister in DC. You went yeah. out to dinner. Yeah, with her sister. Yeah, with Julie's sister. That was fun. Wait, with Julie's sister? Yeah. Oh, I thought you meant with your client. Who's sister. Julie? Julie is my lady. Uh-huh. You went. My you went out with your lady's sister who lives in DC. Never. Yes. Got it. Okay. What was the question Ooh. about traveling? With your employer, when you travel, do you get travel days? What does that mean? So it's like in the government work or military in general, that first day you fly out is considered a travel day. So it's just that day is just traveling. Uh, and so you, so don't you don't start don't have work until the next yeah. day. Now, sometimes that changes depending on the work you're doing, but you typically it's the travel day. Or if you're, no. if you're you flying one, both days. You get one at the beginning and at the end of your military of your time. No. So it's like all the travel day, Monday and Thursday. Oh, yeah. yeah. Do, we, do you get full pay for a day of travel? Yes. And you get overtime right now. So it's like once I step foot out my door, so I, when I get to my hotel, I'm all I'm on the clock. It's overtime. Yeah. Well, it's just hours, and if you go over the certain amount of hours, they pay you for it. Standard uh, time, but if you go yeah. over, do they pay you if you don't go over for travel time? It's like what you, is the pay rate for travel time and the limit? It's, just, it's the same. It depends. It's on just the way, it's just billable hours. Yeah, it's billable okay. hours. There you go. Good word, Grayson. Okay. Clap. Yeah, I uh, insert clap sound bite here. It's fun. I like travel days. Yeah, I don't get travel days. Anyways, yeah, Camilla yeah. Harris isn't gonna win. Yeah, no, I think uh, I I think Warren is coming ahead to the to the she's she's pulling ahead slowly. Yeah. So what are they gonna do? Two debates now, and then one debate later. What yeah, they they're elimination rounding. It. Really? They're yeah. gonna vote them off the island. They well, they raised the requirements, so the pol- are, the polling requirements. So, but who does the polling? Pollsters? Because Trump doesn't no, like any them. poll. Any Trump poll. doesn't like them. Oh, oh no, they have to get one that Trump likes. <laughs> yeah, well, he has to show that he's winning. You know, he can't have a kid in the sandbox with it's the not, sand. A poll that doesn't have Trump in it has to have Trump in it. Yeah. Well, good thing good thing that Trump's not in control of the DNC because they're the ones making the rules. So I and guess the, the uh, DNC yeah. says that they uh, they they just raised the percent polling rate requirement. So it's going to be it's a national poll thing. It's going it to be, be a uh, national poll. Yeah, Warren Sanders, Mayor Pete. I need Bur- I need Biden to get out of the race. He's not going to get out of the race. Sleepy Joe's going to be there forever. I need him to. I I, mean, I don't whatever. I'm I don't to, need him to do anything. I don't want to say too many things right now. I don't know. I know he's he's going to be in there to the final three at least. He, he pulls he so well, and he's only the, by it's just name. He's recognition. He's just the middle of the road Democrat. It's just name ne- name recognition. He's not progressive enough. He's not uh, good enough. He's sleepy Joe. He's creepy. Is it creepy uncle? Yeah, he's 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 just he's just slightly problematic enough. He's like, hey, oh, putting my hands good. on Derek's shoulders. Can you scratch? Can you scratch my back? Like up. I think he's, left, I think he's just slightly problematic left enough down. that he wouldn't be good left. for the party. Like if if he was uh, president. If he was president, they would they would they would spit roast him over everything. Like, 
No, he'd, be, he'd be awful as president. He's going to run a platform that I can beat Trump. I can do it. That's his only platform. Yeah, right? I know. He's just nothing. He'd be a great VP again. And you know what? You know what gave a, a huge blow to that, by the way? All the polls that came out um, that were head to heads. You see yeah. the head to head matchups? No. Everyone in the top five or six spots in a head to head national poll beat Trump by like at least yeah, five I saw. points. Oh, that one I saw. Yeah. Everyone. But that's not true. Pollsters, no. Trump's Trump's going to win. Okay. He's the best. Come on. Yeah. Come on. All right. He, they, I, I believe mean, everything have, he says. If we had midterm level turnout at the in the presidential, he won't win no matter who's against him. We just need we just need we need the turn. It's the turnout Gen that matters. Gen Z's to show up and vote. Yeah. I mean, yeah. It's literally turnout, and th- the worst that they make voters. I think it's wild that America. like you know African Americans, Asians, Latin pe- Latin Americans vote for Trump. Like that's wild to me. Yeah. That they support that guy who if they, if they do. Yeah. Yeah. And it's like this guy is just not like you. And it's like you vote for him. Don't vote it, for him. Please. Well, it's not just that he's not like them. It's that he's consistently um, racist. Inact- yeah, he's cons- consistently said things that are racist, and he's consistently put policies in place that are racist. Concentration camps, everything. Oh my god! The, yeah, the con- Derek, do you hear about the concentration camp thing? No. There's this huge blowback because a, a bunch of Democrats have been saying that the um, the kids in cages are constant. They're in concentration camps. And then there's this huge like internal debate about whether or not it's the right time to use that word. When is the right time? Yeah, <laughs> I, there, I would it's rather summer camp guys. Would, it's the summer. I I I was listening to like a a Dan Harmon uh, episode of his podcast, and he was saying that he would rather err on the side of being of 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 cry of like crying Nazi too soon, ten times out of ten, like a hundred times out of a yeah. hundred. If there's a problem with Nazis, you want to be concerned more than not concerned because all of all of the possible parallel timelines that exist where nazis take over america that happens because people underreact right there's no situation where they take over and people are overreacting it's it's crazy to to think that the correct answer would ever be under respond to nazis right yeah punch him in the face Oh, I need you to put on your conspiracy theory hat again. Oh, okay. Hold on, let me put it on. All right. Can you put it on me? Yeah. No, you have to put, yeah. Yeah, that's the that's the place for the conspiracy theory hat. <laughs> that was a great bit. That, that was a great bit there. Oh, God. Okay. Well, someone's definitely not being molested right now. <laughs> that's what's happening. In... Great background. Yeah, okay. Anyway, moving on. <clears throat> You got clear. <coughs> you, do you want some water? Do you want some like mouthwash after that? No, Grayson. Yeah. Oh, oh check yeah. out this conspiracy theory okay. that I heard about today. We're doing the conspiracy folks. So, did you hear about the news about David Ortiz? Oh yeah, he got shot. The Dominican. He got he got Republic. shot in the in the. No, 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 no. Was it Dominican Republic? Yes, in the DR. He in got the shot. DR. But the DR in authorities are saying. No, they're saying what? That David Ortiz wasn't the intended target. Oh no, who was the intended target? Somebody else His at friend. that table who pissed His friend who pissed off a drug lord. Drug lord. Six years ago, and he waited six years to enact revenge until that very moment. David Ortiz, yeah, wasn't meant to be shot. Fuck, he's also, such a good bro that he stepped in front of a bullet for his friend. So the conspiracy theory is that the DR is lying, so tourists keep coming <laughs> because, because they, they want drug lords. Because they don't want to say they're, they Ortiz don't want to say there's a mafia. And, yeah, they want. They so wait, what's they, the worst? What's the worst scenario here? That Big Poppy was targeted, or that there's a drug lord? They don't because they don't want people to think that citizens are being targeted there. I guess I don't know. And also, oh my god, they don't want pe- they don't want people to think that citizens are being targeted. They don't want them that like celebrities are being targeted down there. But that's that only going to deter usually, celebrities from going, right? But yeah, you, would you go to the DR now? If it was, if they were shooting yes. white people, probably not. <laughs> If, I'm they're, if the you're DR. targeting white people, but they weren't targeting white people. They targeted David Ortiz. They're trying to be like they're shooting. The, there was it was a drug related crime. Nothing involving their god, David Ortiz. It's safe. Everyone come to the DR. A drug related crime is the better alternative. Yes, than, possibility. Then someone getting shooting David Ortiz, Ugh, and also everyone in the god. DR is dying right now at the resorts. Why would they? Are they? Who's dying? Are you guys? Do you guys check the news? Not in no. the DR. Another tourist died in the DR on Sunday. What? Another oh. tourist died Why? in the. Because they're getting sick. Oh. This is like s- you mean the six hospitals or aren't, seven. Aren't good. People are dying in their hotel, hotel rooms. What? You you have not checked the news at no, all? No, I'm not about this. I've been looking at politics. You got to look at the news in the DR. Resorts. I'm, mostly on, I'm mostly on Twitter. 
So if, it's not, if, if you, it's not on the Twitter stream for my bubble, I don't know I'll the number, but like six like or seven more than tourists. 10? Okay, not more are, than ten are dying. If it's less than ten, it doesn't matter. Two of them, a couple, died in the hotel room. They're found dead in their hotel room. Yeah, because of dysentery. Like, I don't know. They don't know what it is, and the, and the DR is blocking any autopsies you're getting out. Well, of course they are. It's a so state. It's a state thing. Wait, what kind of government does DR have? I don't know. Is it but just uh, like a like a Chinese the FBI situation? wants to get involved, and they they, they should. The FBI. They should. And it's killing their tourism industry. Good. I'm not going there their, anymore. Their yeah. economy is primarily primarily from tourism. Right. So it's like Big Poppy gets shot. Tourists are dying. Oh God. Who the fuck wants to go there right now? Yeah. No. 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 The probably the minister of the tourism board is probably like contain the spread of misinformation. It's, they're saying cut it's the, the phone line. That it's like from the mini bar, or if it's like from the poolside bar, somehow they're getting sick. Do you think it's a uh, employees like a like a sabotage thing or is it? I don't know if it's in like in the air vents and to be cleaned. I don't know if it's. I don't know. Hey, I still think that the we don't know red line was a inside. I've job. been seeing a lot of tweets about the red line lately. I'm thinking it's Illuminati. I still think it was an inside job. Hold on, Derek's on his phone. Yes. Yeah, we gotta wait for Derek to get off his phone and contribute to the conversation about. I want to see how many people. No, you guys don't even want to ask tour- me about my week. The tourism industry. Derek, how was your week? Derek, tell us about your week. Tell us about your whole week. What did you do all? No, week? I don't want to talk to you anymore. No, you just want to. Oh, I'm putting you in charge of scheduling out the uh, pedicure thing. Oh, word. I need you to pick a date for us. Oh, give us, God. Give us two you dates. Need, are you saying that <laughs> that I need to find a time we're all free? Yes. That's not that hard. Do it on a weeknight. Yeah. All right. Pedicures are fucking awesome. awesome. Nine. Yeah, we, I need one so, so bad. This is an article from June 20th. Should I, here's a question. Have you gotten a pedicure before? No. Should I clip my nails before the pedicure? Why are you asking No, me? they do it for you. They do it for you? Yeah. I'm that's afraid. That's the best part. Have you gotten a pedicure before? No, I've never gotten one. No. You have them clip it. They, we, we, <laughs> we broke. We broke him. We broke Derek. <laughs> Just they do it. Don't cut you. your nails. Don't cut my nails. They're, they look like ogre nails. So I probably should cut them first. Nine. No, no, no. They'll have have them do it, and then you can tell them how short you want and all that. It's great. I'm scared. Nine. I'm, so okay, this is a backstory. I probably I have a little bit of like PTSD from someone cutting my nail, my toenails as a kid. Yeah, but they're like my parents. They're cutting, professionals. That's probably why I don't cut my toenails enough. Actually, now that I think about it. Anyway, what were you saying? Nine American tourists have died. In Nine. VR. Nine. Oh, that's one away from my limit. <laughs> Nine overall. If it was like ten in the history of no, DR no, tourism, like recently, like this, re- this recent spate of murder slash death. Do you think it's murder? Do you think that's a, it's like possible? I wouldn't count anything out yet. Like they're getting injected with like I don't think they're getting a injected. Dose I think they're getting if anything spiked in their drink or something. Yeah. Oh, okay. That'd be fair. What if they get a lethal dose of roofies in their drink? I don't know. Is there a le- lethal dose they're of roofies? Anything. So the is thing is, a uh, high enough dose. The people who were with it, one of the guys who died said he just got hot. He felt hot. He overheated into possible, or was a fever? I don't know. Well, there's a difference between a fever and st- a heat stroke. Maybe there's something they're giving them. That's maybe it's inducing. heat stroke. Maybe I don't know. What's the, it's summer, right? So maybe maybe it's heat stroke. Is DR above the? It's very equator? strange that the FBI yeah. is getting involved, though. So I don't think it's just heat stroke. I think it could. If this, well, is, the, if this mm, is the case, why haven't more people died in the past? Right. It it would be weird. If the, it, well, what I'm thinking is, I'm thinking there's a drug that's somehow inducing heat stroke. Because a fever feels different from heating up. A fever doesn't. It, a fever is chills and heating up. Grayson, this is I'm a perfect a, case. We need. A, we need to stream this. Grayson, right? I'm uh, seeing a pattern here in the news. I don't look, think look it's up the, a look up the symptoms of heat heat stroke and if you can induce it. I, I feel like if you can fuck up with. Uh, Haven't you seen on Moses, Osmosis Jones? You can induce it. A heat? No, that's a that's a fever. Yeah. A fever. You get chills as well, but heat stroke doesn't feel. I like got a fever. fever. I don't think heat stroke feels the only prescription like a fever. It's more cowbell. More cowbell. I would laugh if your pen just broke. That would be so funny. <laughs> Get this. You mind if I blow some clouds in here? <laughs> On my vape? Yeah, you can do that. That's fine. Uh, you want symptoms yeah. of heat stroke? Yeah. Throbbing, Throbbing headaches, headaches. Dizziness, dizziness and lightheadedness. Lack of sweating, Lack of sweating despite, despite the heat. heat. Red, Red, hot, hot, dry skin, skin. muscle Muscle weakness weakness or cramps, cramps, nausea nausea and vomiting, vomiting, rapid rapid heartbeat, heartbeat, rapid, rapid, shallow shallow breathing. breathing. (laughs) That was a great representation. Thank you for that. No problem. Cures. Drink water. Yeah, room temperature water. Stay out of the sun. Not cold water. Cold water is really bad. Yeah, it's a shock to your system. You'll go into a shock. Is cold water always bad? People say Have it is. Have you ever taken a cold shower? 
a few times. You ever got caught in the rain? It's bad. If you like pina coladas, you might like that. Uh, I do have half a brain, and I'm not into yoga. Oh. You know what I've been drinking? And I, have, and I want to uh, fuck you on the dunes on the cape. Oh, there's another conspiracy theory about that, too. <laughs> <laughs> I've been drinking coconut water for my post-run recovery. Is this like, is this like wobbly? Oh, tighten it up. So, yeah. So, it's like after you run, you're, I sweat so much when I run. Uh, and Gatorade's too much sugar. Yeah. I don't like Gatorade coconut water. Uh, coconut oh, what's water. the other thing? Uh, Pedialyte? Pedialyte's good, too. But I, I'm a big fan like of coconut it. water. Yeah, coconut water is good. It's good does stuff. It have, does it have the electrolytes? Yeah. 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 A little, a little expensive, but uh, little pricey. Yeah, what is, it, what is it? Like four bucks for a thing? Yeah. It depends on where you buy it. I bought, I bought a four pack and it was only eight bucks, so it's not bad. Okay. There's also like different it does, does qualities. Does it taste good? Yeah, it tastes delicious. There's different flavors of coconut water. I like regular and pineapple. There's also a difference between coconut milk and coconut water. It's not a real milk. It's a milk no, substitute. No, no, because like coconut milk is like pure, I think, and then coconut water is diluted. Uh, I don't like I've had coconut milk. I don't like it. It was sweet. I think. Let me check. Thank you for flashing us. No problem. No problem. Where's the cat? Not around you. Ran away the second you came in, actually. She was here when we were here. Sitting yeah, right she there. was just hanging out with us. Can I get her? No. Okay. Coconut mm. milk versus coconut water. Coconut water is indeed the liquid that is found within coconuts. Coconut milk Sick. and coconut cream are both made from grated coconut meat that is macerated with a measured quantity of water. Okay. It's thick like dairy I'm cream. trying to find the thing I had for Derek. Yeah, completely different thing. One of them is made of trying coconut to find the thing for Derek. meat. Hey, so Karen on Twitter asked a question. And oh, I think, really? I think, we got a question? No, it was just she tweeted it out, and I oh, saw it, and okay. I thought of Derek, because Derek likes sports. Yeah, like tweet. Uh, she, listeners, so this tweet, was, tweet uh, at us at sl- under, sli- wait, slightly biased underscore? Yeah. Slightly biased underscore on Twitter for questions. Uh, she, so this was after uh, the Stanley Cup finals were over, and she asked someone to give her a crash course on how NHL free agency trades, salary caps, and all that fun stuff works. Because And nonsense. also a list of which Bruins I should prepare myself to not have on the team next season. I saw that tweet. I saw you tweet that. I, I responded to it, yeah. yeah I saw so you tweet that. So dig into this one, bucko. Do it. Sports. How to, sports how to free- talk with Derek. Derek Sports Corner. How does uh, sports work? Let me. Uh, I want to need, read it to you. I need. Well, I need to see it. Okay. For reference. I want to read it to you. Don't trust Derek with your phone. All right. <clears throat> so, so I need to know. All right. So salary caps. So basically, the league sets a cap for each team to have on their payroll for each year. So, so it's total. It, but it's not the same on each team. No, it's the same for each team. Where does the team's salaries come from? Revenue. Where does oh, the revenue like the, how do the players yeah. get paid? No, no, I mean like where, where does, does that money, money? Where does money where come does the, from? Where does the team get that money? Uh, I mean, it's generally ticket sales. Oh, uh, okay. There's generally like most leagues will have uh, an agreement with players where they'll get like a split on like league revenue. Is it purely ticket or is it also merchandising? Yeah, it's probably a mix. It depends on the league. Like some okay. leagues, like I believe the NBA has a fifty-fifty revenue split with the players. Okay. Drafts tonight. Um. Yeah, the NBA draft is tonight. Um. Ooh. Big deal. Ooh, face ID. Uh, let's see. Sucks. So salary Seamless. caps. That's easy. Perfect. Uh, NHL Wait, free. Hold on, hold on. Do uh, do the Bruins have to pay the NHL to be in the league? Do they pay fees? League or dues? membership. Um, or do they just I'm have to be good enough to get? I don't in? know that. I'm sure they pay. Like, how does the I'm NHL sure they pay. Paid, like, they probably pay. Uh, they probably pay a percentage of their revenue. I think they oh. negotiate with the studios or the well. The also, like the, the NHL. Yeah, the NHL also like. You know, they have deals with, with networks. The, the TV and all networks, because yeah. they make money on the commercials. Yeah. And then the, um, the networks probably pay the league, because yeah. the league is the one who schedules the games. Generally, yeah. And then the league probably pays cuts of the of the revenue from the viewership to the teams that are playing in that game. Yeah. Uh, so salary caps we covered. Free agency, if a player is not under contract. So I believe how it works in the NHL is... When they their contract is about up, they become a restricted free agency. Or what does that mean? A restricted free agent. I'm not sure on this for the NHL, but basically it means that the team who previously you had a uh, contract with has first right to negotiate oh. for then, you. For you, okay. and then I also believe that if another team offers a higher amount, that team has the ability to match that offer. Right. Okay. So it's oh, like okay. I'm gonna put this much like bidding on players. 
And then if another team bids higher, you get a chance to bid higher again. It's like your you parents, don't. Have, I think you just have to match it, and then they like have to sign with you. It's like when your parents get divorced, and like your mom gives you five dollar allowance, and your dad then matches it for your love. Yeah, yeah. but if your mom gives you more, you then a, you have to stay with your mom. No, but if your dad your gives dad, you six dollars. Then if you your have dad to stay with your can dad. match it, then it's equal love. If he doesn't yeah. match it, then it deals off. Trades, do you want to talk? Gone. Do you want to talk about this a little bit more? Vinny? I do. Your date was canceled, right? <laughs> so trades I'm free all night straight baby straightforward. to be your therapist Hell yeah that's you can, my fetish you can trade uh, in the NHL you can trade um, players you can trade a player for a draft pick you, I believe you can you, trade a player for a draft pick what is a draft pick when so they draft every year like why would you trade a player and what and how many picks do you get per player does it matter which player is it i mean it's all it's all negotiated yeah i mean like if you have like the next star of the league in the draft or projected then that could be a good good trade you know yeah i believe i don't know if you can do in the nhl but some leagues you can uh trade (laughs) for cash it's like when you go to adopt a kid you want a better one yeah, so you can trade in your kids for money pick at the kid you can sell your kids for money i guess if, if you want to think about it that way yeah um, and then as far as Bruins that she should prepare herself for, so I heard that the one I know that there is question around David Backus. I believe that Nesson confirmed that he was going to be coming back. Um, I'm trying to remember, there was one more, but yeah, I heard, I heard Krug might leave. I didn't hear that. I heard on ninety eight point five the Sports Hub, Boston Sports Radio. Boy, I wish any of these words made. Have sense you heard? To me. Have you heard their their? Do you listen to that at all? Ninety eight five. Which which uh which? Oh, I guess shit. Which program on there? I forgot. I have a donut. It, it doesn't really matter. But have you heard the New England Fat Loss commercials? No. Oh, they're actually. I think I have. The jingle actually. is so funny. Oh, New nut. England. New England Fat Loss dot com. <laughs> yeah, I've heard that. Yeah, totally. Have you heard the, I have the a commercial? Donut over here. Uh, where they're talking about the pipeline. Mm, it's no. Good. And they're just like, if we lose the pipeline, you will hear 90,000 more trucks each day. And it comes What is a s- pipeline? What does that mean? Like a gas pipeline. What? Delivering gas through like the mountains and stuff to go from each stations and stuff or oil or some gas. I don't Where know. Is, is, is it in the city? Where is it going? It's going to different spots in the country. Who? But it has nothing to do with Boston? No, it's just general pipeline. They don't want to lose what? pipelines. Who, no one's going to take away your guns. I mean, pipelines. Pipelines. Yeah. Well, they remember they were de- protesting putting a new one in out west. Yeah, but they're not going to take away the existing one. Hey, you, they got they got money to spend on lobbying for stuff. This is the this is their this is their game. I'm it's saying a, they're dumb, Grayson. It's a conspiracy. I'm saying their ads are dumb. It's not really gas in the pipeline. It's bodies. They are delivering bodies to the secret in the pipeline. underground bases. The Illuminati is out there, and they will get you. Yeah, yeah. ASMR. I'm gonna eat this theories. donut. What do you want, Derek? Nom, nom. Can you get the cat? Where is she? Under the desk. No, we're recording a podcast right now. Just cut that out. That was the worst. I'll echo it. Don't worry. Oh no. <laughs> Can you get the cat? Please? I'm so sorry. Please. Oh god. So the drafts, NBA drafts tonight. Uh, Kyrie Irving's gone from the Celtics. He's donezo. Yeah. Do you think Durant's Durant's Good not gonna leave Golden State, right? Because he's all fucked up next season anyway. Why would he leave? Uh, I heard he wants to go to the Nets with Kyrie. Car- no, the Nets want Kyrie, but unless only if they can get a better person to go with him. They want a number one, Kyrie not a number Irving. two. Yes, I know that name. He's gonna sell Uncle that's Drew. A, that's a name Uncle I know. Drew? <laughs> Uncle Drew. Uncle Kyrie Irving. Uh, yeah. And uh, this is a really good donut. That's fucking amazing. The viewers hear it. They it, has, know it, it has apple in it. I don't like that donut. I'll get her after Derek. Okay. So Kyrie's leaving. Yep. Uh, Mar- What's the other guy leaving? Robin Williams? <laughs> <laughs> Al- no, he, already, Al- he already left. Al Horford, reportedly. Reportedly, Al Horford. He's done. He's going, he wants a four-year deal somewhere else. Reportedly, he's get, he reportedly they think he can get a four-year, $100 million deal. I mean, he's That's like, wild. Well, he's like 37, That's too. That's not happening. I mean... Age? Yeah. $100 million for a 37-year-old? What much. is he, Tom Brady? That's too much. Tom Brady's 45. He's forty. No, he's not. No, he's not. He's not forty-five. I think he's forty-two. Yeah, or forty-three. That's I think he's still fi- older than thirty-seven. I think he's sixty-five. Yeah. He's about to retire. Bill Belichick is sixty-five. I cannot get her, Derek. If you get the cat right now, this is the worst podcasting I know, ever. I know. I- she used to. She used to join the podcast. Vinny and I used to put blankets all over the apartment. Oh yeah. And then we put a blanket on Just the table the good and she liked old it. Days. I, found, I found a picture. In Waltham. I found a picture of Vinny sleeping in lockup today. 
Really? Yeah. Can I see it? It was in the Snapchat. I don't have it. It's anymore. in the Snapchat group. In our Snapchat group. Uh, it's a. I found pictures on my Google Photos library of 2011 or 2012. Yeah, that's of, all right. Of Vinny. Actually, probably 2011. 2012, Take, I left. Taking a nap in lockup. Did you snap it to us? Where, it's in the Snapchat group. It's literally there. Just go look for it. The Snapchat just, just safe? Just try. Yes. <sighs> Derek, best. try. Scroll up. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Christ. No, the one above that one. You passed it already. It's, yeah, it's, it's, the, that it's one. the second. It's that, it's that one. It's the second message. Oh, me. that was another message. I didn't know Just that. Just white. Oh yeah, no, no. It it uh it doesn't. It's yeah. It was two messages. That's not lock up. Can I see it? Oh, that's the manager floor. Yeah, that's the manager. Yeah, that's right. the MOD that's, office. That's the, man, that's the manager office, right? Oh yeah, the mod. <laughs> Derek, you have a call on Park One. Derek, uh, Park One. I fucking hated the parks. Just put it on hold and I'll take it. Derek, Park One. Ugh. Know what I love about retail? Like, probably like, the one of the best use at retail is when they gave us the headsets. I love the headsets so much. I also have a picture of Jeff. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He doesn't answer my texts anymore. Really? Yeah. No, really? He, we were in a, I was in a group text with him and Ste- Steph and Anthony and Jeff, and Jeff never responded. I wonder how Jeff's doing. I'm going to find this picture of Jeff. I wonder how Jeff is. Jeff, are you okay? Annie, are you okay? Are you okay? Annie, are you Annie? okay? Are you okay? Uh, 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 (laughs) That was terrible. That was amazing. Echo it. Um, Echo it. Do it. What else is? What else is? uh, T O M. What's else? What else is Tom? Top of mind, boys. What's top of mind? Um, f- you know, going to Arkansas next week. Never been there. <laughs> I hope I have a good time. I'm gonna buy some. Ma- I can buy two new magnets when I'm down there. Magnets. Ad- Atlanta. Oh, yeah, you like magnets. And Little Rock. Wait, yeah. oh, are you flying to Hartfield to um, was it to, Jax- Jackson? Jackson Hartfield or whatever the Atlanta airport is. Whatever it's called, the main hub. Yeah. It's the, the hub. It's, it's the big. It's the busiest airport in the country. Yeah. Or the world. I don't know. Yeah. Probably the world. And uh, I'm looking forward to it. I like airport magnets because they have a certain level of tackiness that you just can't replicate anywhere else. It's, a, it's like a good level of tackiness. It's like yeah. not too tacky. Cheesier the better. That's what I always say. Give me that grilled cheese. I had mac and cheese for lunch today. It's delicious. Uh, July 4th is coming up. Oh, I'm starting a new podcast miniseries. What's it about? It's, it's entitled Hulkamania. It's about uh, the Hulkster. Oh, yeah. Hulk Hogan. I had so many names in there. Oh, Really? And uh, um, so I'm going to be reviewing all Hulk Hogan's theatrical movie releases. Like, uh, wait, wasn't okay. he in that one that we watched part of? The, that was uh, not, it's not with all the boobs. He's not in Stone Cold. Okay. That is, that is Brian, the Bo- Brian Bosworth. Oh, the boss. So yeah, Hulk Hogan was in theatrical movies. They're really bad and I'm going to watch them. And I have to. Run six miles on Sunday. Not looking forward to that. No. I'm gonna do it because it's part of my resolutions. Do it, you won't. Oh yeah, we're we're you know we're it's almost ha- it's about half year now, guys. So how's your uh, re- resolutions coming? Um, I know you don't have any, so it doesn't make a difference for you, Derek. I think oh, I did say I found him. Oh, I know who the other. That's a vet next to him. Yeah, right? that's a vet. I found him. You should te- text that to me. I'll text say, it I'll to you. That's Jeff right now. Yeah. Why? I want to see if Jeff responds. All right, I'll send it. I'll to send you. it. To the, I'll send it to the group text. I'll put it. With, I'll put it in the Snapchat. Steph and Anthony. I'll put it in the Snapchat. Can you just send it to me through a text, man? You can save things from Snapchat. <sighs> it's like another step. No, you just open Snapchat. It, it'll be the photo. Grayson, please. Just, just long click yeah. the photo. Save. Come on, hurry up! Only have ten minutes left. Send it to me. All right, I send it. Talk, Derek. Say something interesting, Derek. Um. The viewers are counting on us. The cat is in here, and I'm excited about that. Hi, Pippa. How are you? Oh. You saw this picture, right? <laughs> yeah. I have more of them. Oh, you do? There's two more. Terrific. <laughs> <laughs> Good memories, right? Best, t- best of times. Best worst times of times of my life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. I'm cropping it now because I couldn't save it the way you wanted me to save it. What are you talking about? Shut up. You just long click it. Don't be mean, Grayson. So what are you guys doing this weekend? Look, save in camera roll. Look. It's already done. Too late. What are you guys doing this weekend? This weekend? Are we 
D and Ding this weekend. Yeah, I, we I, are. Are you just retired? Like, are you ever gonna play? It's, it's tough because it's summer now, and I have a lot of shit going on. And I'm doing the fucking six mile race on Sunday, and I know I'm gonna be afterwards. I'm not yeah, gonna play D and D. That's true. Are you coming on Sunday? I think so. Yes. Where are you gonna play? Um, my place in Mission Hill is available. I have a table. It's not as big as Mezzo or anything like that, but it's a table. It's like a it's like a standard dining room table. Hopefully, so, eventually we could. We could play at my new apartment. You just got to ease her into it, you know, butter yeah. her up. Ease her into it. Yeah. There's a lot of things you can accomplish if you just ease her into yeah. it. Oh, on Sunday, by the way, when you try to go out, your apartment in the common area, it's going to be packed with people. The BAA road races at the common. I don't usually. I'm just letting you know. I don't I'm letting you know. <laughs> Calm I'm down. just doing you a favor. Fuck you, Derek. God. Oh, my goodness. Fuck. Oh, my goodness. Okay, no one's responded yet to my text message here. Vinny guys. screenshotted my chat. <laughs> it's even creepier. Oh my goodness! No, that's not news. Oh, do you have? You said you want you have a guest who wants to be on. Yeah, I have actually a few. Ooh. I have actually a bunch. Can you give me a list of these people and I'll contact them for you? No, yeah, because you're never gonna do it. Yeah, that's that's fair. Yeah, I can give you. A huge I job. want to do so. July, it's four. There's four weeks in July. I want to have a different guest on each de- each each week. Okay, in, ju- in July. In July, just see uh, I, a I can person re- who's never been re- on the podcast. We have four slots to fill. Yeah. Well, July 4th week's going to be kind of shitty rough. We'll try our best. But we have four slots to fill. I have some people I could run by. They've you. never been on the podcast. I want th- new people on this podcast. I could I could run some people by you. Well, he has a bunch of people that he has already. Okay. Does and he have four? I don't... He doesn't tell me how many I people I have, like, are. seven. That, that, well, that the question is... Are oh, Jeff available? responded finally. No That's way. Right. What do you say? Steph said, hi, Jeff. And Jeff wrote, God, look at all that glorious hair. <laughs> 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 Oh man! <laughs> Look at all that. so sexy. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, <laughs> Do you think Je- Anthony wrote Jeff is glowing? <laughs> Jeff is glowing. Oh my god! What? What do you put the mic? <sighs> that's like that's like. Oh my god! It's like just enough to edit out. Um. So good yeah. times at Staples High. Staple? Yeah, it really was a high school. Good times at at Rip Staples High. <laughs> No, Derek, no. It's a cat. <laughs> no. She's I'm so gonna write Jet Grayson and Derek think so. Grace think you think you're sexy? Is that the question? No. Because Anthony wrote Jeff is glowing. This is not good pot. This is a pretty What sh- are you doing? Oh. What are we doing? I don't know. This is why we need guests. Welcome. We, we, need, we need new we need some new blood uh, in this thing. Yeah. Well, imagine, it's, it's, imagine, we just not talk about Imagine politics. if this was just us. But Wait, this is just us. He would just be a cooler light. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> the the course light did help. Well, I think the podcast runs best when we're talking about things that we're enthusiastic about. We just have to talk about more things we're enthusiastic about and people will like it. Yeah. Please don't send that. I'm sending it. Let me take a better one. It's too late. It's sent automatically. It's iOS. Let me see it. No. I need to see the picture. You just you, you look, know they hate me. You look so ha- Anthony definitely does. I, I don't fuck think, Anthony. I don't, I don't think care about Jeff Anthony. and Steph really give a no, shit. No, they definitely hate me. I don't think so. They definitely do. They fire you? No. You wore a suit to your interview both times. The same suit. I didn't interview twice. I do love I that. You did. I no. can't believe you wore a suit to your interview. Yeah. Balls on you, man. Like it I was wore, my first job interview ever. I wore a suit to my manager interview. Uh, there. It was the first Derek, interview I'd ever First been impressions to. matter. You know what I wore to my interview for this job? That I have now, basically this. Yeah, it's business casual. Business Nobody casual, wants to yeah. you in a suit. I, just whatever I would have worn every day. Nice. Let me see the. Let me see the chat. I'm talking to Stephanie you need this, now. You need to show me this because you sent me into this. It's relevant. You look good. Do they ask what I look like? I don't don't just send an old Wait, picture. Scroll, yeah. scroll, up. <laughs> scroll up. Scroll up. What did Anthony say? Nothing yet. What's a gray thing? That's all you wrote. He doesn't like you. I know he doesn't like me. I want to have him on, but it just means getting him from here to, to if, be on it with if you. I, if we bring him on, he's going to punch if, me in the face. What if we drove out there? For no reason. <laughs> just like went on our field trip and record like five episodes in a day. What do, what do you think the odds of I, him just cold clocking me are? None of us are? have the longevity to do five episodes in one day. I think we do. I do not. It, I, alcohol would not be involved. It would be caffeine. Caf, caffeine. Wait, wait, wait. Why would we do five in a I'm day? Just, that was just shows the number I picked in my head. Why would we? Three in a day. Why would we do three if in a day? Pits, just the, the road show. We're going on a tour. We could do three days. You gotta, you gotta come to Pittsburgh with me can one time. You, can, can you imagine him for th- can <laughs> him to do three days? Why would we do three in a day? <laughs> we're going stupid. on a road trip. Why don't we just do one for the day though, and condense it? Grayson, why would we? How? 
This is a stupid. I don't. <laughs> I, do like, I do like the roadshow idea. We I want to do go a roadshow, but it doesn't need to be three in a row. Why not? Be one. I can do three in a row. Condense it. If cut you, the, if you had, I'm being the Caroline right now. Cut the fat and make the podcast slimmer. I don't. So the good, deserve three episodes. So the, the good news is we're at time. We're still talking about the roadshow. Also, we're at, we have five minutes. The pod show. Oh, we have five minutes. Yeah. The podcast roadshow. Do show. we do fifty minutes? Sure. Po- oh. Why wouldn't this would work? I want to do a podcast roadshow. Yeah, we have all if the portables. This would work. We, I never said have, it wouldn't. We, I should. We, I said have, we shouldn't do three episodes. S- well, we I'm have saying, roadshowed it before. We have. The New York or, files. New, New Orleans. Or the New Orleans files. Oh yeah, that was wor- New, no, or, New no. Orleans. We. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think we do still have some unreleased from that. I. I just think. Oh, no, that's the del- that's no, the no, that's the lost episode. No, they're out. They're out. Is there you released the lost episode? No, the last episode's not in New Orleans. The last episode's broken audio. <laughs> oh, never mind. What did they say? Stephanie wrote, "Do you podcast about aliens, conspiracy theories?" I wrote, "Sometimes." And then Anthony smoked. If we've smoked marijuana, Anthony wrote, "Did we smoked marijuana during it?" Did we no. smoked marijuana? <laughs> That's just me, you know, adding t- it. T- t- <laughs> never mind. I'm not I think he just that. wants us to be the Joe Rogan podcast. Steph, Steph, I would. We should get Steph on. She lives in Connecticut now. S- Steph would come on. Connecticut. That's, that's, that's how I remember how to spell that's it. That's the wrong way. The wrong way of the roadshow. The roadshow is going this way. Oh no! I'm just saying she can call in. Like, I know. Oh, I guess she has what I want to buy next. What? Oh my god! What, what? I want to buy for the podcast. I'm gonna show it to you. Oh, like a, is it like a, a Facebook? No, no, no. You'll see. Virtual visit to your six grandparents. Six, six, what is it? Six hundred dollars. What is it's it? A, it's a podcast board. <laughs> oh, okay. A, like a soundboard. A, yeah, but it's okay. I'll show it to you. Is after. it gonna have like, uh, like a MIDI, the, like a MIDI controller? It has Bluetooth on it for your phone to pair with it. Oh, that's pretty cool. So it's interface itself. Can you put and it has six files on it from your phone? Like so if like one of us like had to be remote, we could do that. No, no, it has nothing to do with the remote, does it? It's just a soundboard. Oh. Turn on my head from Grayson. Yes, what well, you're saying. Yes. What? Yeah. So so it has the four inputs for the mics. Yeah. The four headphones out at the back. It it has an interface for your phone to pair with it, so you can actually make phone calls with it. And have them on the podcast oh, recorded. And it also like has, a like a speakerphone, like an yeah, office. but it's through your headphones. Yeah, it pairs okay. with it. It's interface. Right. It's a mic interface. Think of it as a microphone. Okay, okay. And it has six buttons on the side for a soundboard. Oh, that's awesome! All right, how that's much pretty is cool. Six hundred six hundred dollars. Oh, I'll definitely contribute. Put, yeah, I'll definitely. I probably it's, can't contribute. I, I got. I remember I got asked the. I got asked like a week ago, like how much do you make from the podcast? I go. You mean how much? Do how we, much do we spend? How on much the do we spend on the podcast? How much money have we lost? Yeah. <laughs> All, everything, I'll show it to you right now. Everything we've spent so far. Oh, it's not. It's a road. Never mind, it's a road. I keep, I How much do you make Heiser. from the podcast? It was very funny. From our 60 listeners. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> We love all 60. <laughs> I'm just saying they're not going to let us advertise. So, yeah, it has that the four inputs. So sick. It has an interface to plug your computer into it. Can you imagine how fun it would be to record ads, though? I'd be pretty, do, I would do pretty, ads right now. Be pretty make a, I'll make up ads. No, no. And then it has, we don't want to. No, real ads. We'll make an ad after Some this. Some witty banter. You want? They want witty. The listeners I want witty, witty banter during. So we should do. Look at it as your phone. Look Not at this fun. fucking thing. As eight buttons on the side for how, a soundboard. How, how creative do you feel on a normal day? I'm always creative. Do you ever? It's so much enough to play Minecraft. It, it's enough. <laughs> I mean, we me, could, I need caffeine. It's a problem. I need caffeine to be caffeine. We could do some a mix of like red letter media, or I don't know if you ever watched Tim and Eric when they do their product commercials. Come here. It's free real estate. <laughs> it's, free real, it's, free real it's free real estate. It's free real estate. It's free real estate. Speaking of Tim, you guys should watch us because Tim's in that movie and he's oh. fucking great. In jo- it. Oh, Joe, if you guys like Tim and Eric, which is challenging to like, because I love them. Like they're good. Eric. Have you watched his cooking shows online? The cooking shows are so funny. It's so good. Dude, so there, I guess my brother was telling me like their like protege or whatever has a show called I Think You Should Leave on Netflix, and it is oh my god, and it's wild. Is this the same style of humor as Nathan for you? Uh, worse. Yeah, it's I'm like, not into it. Then. It's like Eric Andre. I can't, but worse because I Eric can't, Andre is so good. Eric Andre is awesome. I can't watch Nathan for you. Why Nathan for you is fun? It's the opposite of like my Eric, type of sense of humor. Do you like Eric Andre? I don't know who that is. You get <gasps> the Eric Andre show. I, if if you're if you're thinking of things that are similar or worse, yeah, you won't like than it. Nathan yeah. for you. I just it's, said I don't like it. So I, don't know, Nathan, I never ever seen Nathan for you. I that's literally like, that's really just, sad. Just I feel bad for you. I don't like that sense of humor. I, genu- okay. I genuinely okay. feel bad for you. No, I'm too empathetic. I feel bad for the people that that they're like making fun Do of. You, what about celebrities? What if they make fun of celebrities? That's fine. They they can make oh. Eric, the Eric Andre show is there. That's fine. I'll show you a clip after this. If they're trolling add. celebrities, Eric Andre celebrities when he goes to the it. RNC. <laughs> yeah, he goes to the that, RNC uh, and he uh, trolls Alex Jones and shit. No, that's hilarious. If it's people who deserve it, that's All right, fine. We'll wrap it up. I'm some clips right now. We'll wrap it up. What? 
Bye. I'll try some clips. Bye bye. Oh, oh right. Until oh, you the want to show me clips. until okay. the road show, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye bye. We'll talk about it out off air. We out. Bye. You. If you can dream it, you can do it. Life's what you make of it.